All right, so I just wanted to show you, um, you know, the inside of that pipe. You see how we squared everything off. It's behind the ridge, um, and uh, that's what's up. So it's three inch squared to mimic this, and we did that all with, um, you know, a vise. As you can see there, how it's kind of squared, and you can see the pinch. Um, from it, but yeah, so it worked and That's the transition of flow from uh, Three inch to that so I just need to weld the outside and then see if I can you know do a little um, Not really adding material but using the material as there the only issue I have with that Is that this material you know, if the flange is thicker, so you got to put a higher heat to get that to melt. But then once you hit this, it could, you know, possibly blow a hole because this is a thinner material which requires less amperage. So um, that's you know one of my dilemmas too uh, when I'm doing some some welding. Um, but at least if I build up the outside and then I come and I um, what do you call it? Come do the inside, then I you know should be fine i you know some of that material will blow and like see like that once i start heating that up i could tap that out even though that's like literally like a 132nd or something i don't know but yeah it's all about just you know transition to flow but if you guys had any questions about that squared it off hammer and you know either chisel or something you know to like get your edges on a um vice use it like an anvil so that's uh that's what's up i'm about to take this guy well i ended up buying the cheap um ebay not really cheap ebay but just a cheap um slave cylinder from ebay and it was vice versa like it's just hilarious you know they always do all this shit so basically this is how it should sit, but when I went to go put it on the car, it was like backwards, and so, oh, wait up. Well, anyways, you can see how the piston and that, so the tab should be on this side like this. So I ended up going to AutoZone, buying the right one, then I'm going to take that back and say, hey, you guys gave me the wrong part. Because um, especially that shit was $40. Then I am going to take this guy. I'm gonna go to Fleet Pride today. I'm gonna take the the turbine with me. Um, I'm gonna see if I can find this flange and um, V band clamp so I can keep on going. I'm probably once I get this, I'm gonna need like a four inch to a um, what do you call it? Um, three and a half inch adapter, and then do the same thing that I did with the other, you know. Um, downpipe or you know exit on the turbo with the he and just like cut it close it in tap it down while i'm welding and whatever but at least i'm making progress so all right